David at uh, Shed in Austin, Texas. I just stayed in town. Most of my family lives here. So we just got together at dinner. It was pretty low-key, honestly. We got there at like 3.30 and we were out of there by 7, you know? So it was pretty chill. Get you in the holiday spirit. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm going to LA in the next month, but not for like Christmas. I have a friend that's graduating and uh, she wanted us to come. I was like, well, I'm going to go and spend the money to get over there. I might as well just go for like a week. Yeah. yeah. We got some pretty decent flights, too. That's one frontier, I'm close here, that's the one that I'll never do again. Yeah. Southwest is right now. We're, uh, we'll be headed on vacation, I guess a week, a beginning thing. And it's all for 20% service. So basically all you pay is crap. Oh, really? So it's not just food and everything else, it's, it's, it's any, of, any of those on-site services. Like the spa and everything. And then also excursions. <laughs> Friends. He went on a run, his honeymoon in there and had the same report. So have you planned anything for your trip in LA? Kind of. The, the hard part is if we're not like renting a car. So we're uh like with the friends that are there, some of them are gonna be free. So we're hoping that they like will take us places and stuff. But they're kind of bad planners. So uh I might just like wall out and just get Uber everywhere. Um, there's like play, there's like things I want to do. I just don't know if like everything I want to do is gonna happen, just because LA is so far apart. And I wish I could have. I wish I could go back in time and live there in like the '70s, but it wasn't expensive, you know. Yeah. <laughs> have you ever seen uh, Pumping Iron? That's what I was gonna say. Like when yeah. Arnold Schwarzenegger. Yeah. Pumping, pumping Iron. Iron and, yeah. Muscle Beach. You, you gotta, you gotta think, man. Like that guy had just gotten here from Austria. Like, there's no way he had like a hundred dollars to his name, you know. Yeah. And he was living in Venice Beach. He definitely made it work out. Yeah. I mean, The Rock's the same way. Oh, this guy's never the Rock is one of my favorite. He's yeah. my favorite characters. Amazing. My favorite people in general. Yeah, me too. Uh, I was talking to somebody else, and I was like, I can't think of. Him not doing any movies in the last like three years. Like I feel like he's just like constantly filming his next film. He had an assortment of hats. Gordon did. He brought a bunch of hats with him, and he was like. Bruno, you can look good at any hat. And he's like, look, look. He's like, I'm going to put it on, and I'll put it on here. <laughs> They're great hats. It was, it was ridiculous. Yeah, I think it's a good dude. I mean, Do you usually square the back, back or taper it? You can usually taper it, right? Yeah. Cool. You see the trailer for uh, The Lion King? Oh, man, it's incredible. I mean, the trailer basically looks like the trailer from 1994, you know? But it's all like, brand new CGI, so right. it just looks incredible. So it shows that she has some Paw Patrol. Yeah, um, yeah. Well, that one's a pretty popular one. Oh, man. What's the one? It's the fish one. Um, oh, I know what you're about. Yeah. She watches that. She loves that one. Okay. And she watches Sesame Street. I remember they used to make, like, little movies. And, uh... My dad would take me to the public library, and uh, they would have them there. They would have like the VHSs there, and you could you could like rent them for free. Yeah, that was the cool thing about the library was you could just check them out for free. I think Blockbuster used to like charge you if you didn't rewind it. Do you remember that? <laughs> Yeah. 
I, I, I haven't watched a few seasons. So now they're now they're, they're Mexico, going to Mexico, yeah. right? Yeah. So it's like a whole new thing. So I think they're just gonna like it branches like, off. Yeah. Like new, new cartel. Yeah. So it's like narcos, like Mexico. Right. Um, Said prices yet? But I'm guessing. I'm guessing they'll probably like try to undercharge Netflix. They'll probably be like eight bucks or something, you know. They used to have a lot of content too. But they've like slowly been losing all their content. Yeah, my mom wants to take some of those. Thanks for watching this video. Beardbrand has launched a private community called The Alliance. It's for men who are looking to invest in themselves and who are looking to keep on growing. Click the link over there and come join us or stick around and watch some more awesome videos.